What's up gamers, Sixpenny here, and today I'm gonna to show you how you can use your ball player in Diamond Dynasty in MLB The Show 22. I received a lot of questions last year on how to do this. This was probably my most asked questions on how to use your ball player. So today I'm gonna to show it to you. If you get some help out of it, drop a like, consider subscribing for more tutorials and gameplay videos. But let's go ahead and dive in. So if you didn't know how to get to your ball player that you either created on Road to the Show or when the game opened up, it's, it's actually at the top left of the screen. You just go up to the main menu to the very top. There's a red circle around your profile picture there. That's where you're going to access your, your ball player. Now, what's unique about this year is you can have multiple ball players, which is cool. But last year, if you remember, it was your primary archetype. If we go to the loadout, it was your primary archetype. For me, it's Speedy Slugger. It was your primary archetype, that first preferred, preferred position that says first base there at the bot the right side underneath speedy slugger that first position was where they appeared in diamond dynasty that is not the case this year this year when you create your character you actually pick their position and that's where they're going to show up this year you can have multiple ball players so when you when i go to manage here this is how you can remove ball players you can create or change the ball player so say you have a pitcher a left fielder first baseman or a pit a player from every position which you can actually do say you have a player from every position but you want your left fielder in diamond dynasty or your starting pitcher so if i want my starting pitcher i would hit a to change ball player to jill random just a random one that was made by default or if i want a left fielder i would choose the left fielder now once you choose them you're going to go over to diamond dynasty okay so once you're in diamond dynasty you're going to go to manage squad and in Manage Squad, you're going to pick the position that you put your player in. And the active member has to be the active player you selected. So my pitcher will not show up right now because that's not my active ball player. But I'm going to click left field and there Ryan Gamer is. Now, if you have a lot of players, they're probably going to be at the very bottom because they're always going to show as 65 overall. These players, don't be alarmed. It's always going to show that your player is 65 overall. It, for some reason, the game, the cards to the right, it's the same thing in this game, just like the last game. It doesn't update the overall. So you're going to go into the game and be like, wait, my stats aren't applied. This is not showing any of the archetype boost. It's not showing the actual player's stats. Now, when you get in the game and actually play with that player, hit start and look at them, you, you can actually look in and go to their player card and see their attributes. It may not show up, but you can tell because when you go for a swing, when they're at bat, you'll see the hitting stats on the feedback on the left side of the screen. It'll show you their power and contact. So that's how you know that the stats are actually being applied. But if you remember last year, I got so many questions. Everybody was like, wait, my player's 65 overall, but they're 90 overall. I'm like, yeah, it's because the player cards are not right and they still didn't fix that this year i will say so they didn't fix it the overall does not update and neither do this the, do the overall when you compare it look at Kit, nick castellanos ryan gamer they're not even close that's not ryan gamer stats he's he's better than that uh, so now hopefully this may be something that starts updating in the future you all have to let me know by the time you're watching this they may actually update that'd be pretty sweet now if i go to center field Ryan Gamer doesn't show up there. They don't have secondary positions. So you cannot actually, I wouldn't find them if I did that second placement. Or if, like last year, that first preferred position, if I go to first base, Ryan Gamer's not there. Uh, so now, let's say I wanted my pitcher in. We'll just do this real quick just to show you all. If you want the pitcher in, you go up, go to manage, create or change ball player. I'm going to hit A, select Joe Random, go back out, go back out, go back into Diamond Dynasty. And then you're going to go into the rotation. So manage squad. You're going to go to right trigger rotation. And I'm going to hit A on a starting pitcher. And there's Joe Random. First one that appears up there because it's 65 overall. <laughs> so that is how you actually do it with multiple ball players. See, I can switch between them. Now, if I change my active, if I go back and change my active player. So I'm gonna show you just for demonstration purposes so you can see this. If I go here, create or change, and I switch to Ryan Gamer, because maybe I'm playing Road to the Show, and then I go into Diamond Dynasty, and I wanna put Joe Random in. We'll go to Rotation Pitchers. Joe Random's not there, because it's not my active player. It has to be your active player. You have to activate them each time. They will go out of your lineup. 
So be on the lookout for that. If you're playing Road to Show with multiple characters and Diamond Dynasty with a different one, make sure you, you have to go back and change it. Now you can edit your ball player within Diamond Dynasty by going to the top left, but you cannot manage or change your ball player within Diamond Dynasty. You have to do that at the main menu. So you have to back out, go here, and then manage. So once you load into Diamond Dynasty, it already pulls in your active ball player. But I will say, I haven't found a way to actually change your player's position. So that's one I've not been able to find. Uh, once you create that player, I've not found a way to actually go in and edit their position. So I think once you lock in that position, left field, they're stuck in left field and they don't seem to have any secondary positions. Same thing with whatever position you put them in. Uh, so that is how you do it, gamers. If you got some enjoyment, drop a like. Subscribe if you want to see more. Click the full playlist in the description for other tutorial videos. You all are all legends. Check out the full Road to the Show playlist. But as always, gamers, have fun and have a fantastic day.